why don't we uh, just calm down? Us. And I love when the angry Pat, uh, I know. Yeah, out of control person. <laughs> what do you okay. By we, I mean myself. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yours what would truly. Calm you down. Uh, here's something. Uh, this is kind of cool. Uh, the uh, Great Lakes Shipwreck Historical Society. Oh, uh, the Great Lakes Shipwreck has uh, made <laughs> you know a special this. announcement. This is in the wake of the death of Gordon Lightfoot. Oh no! The um, <laughs> oh, the oh, uh, oh, man no. behind one of I think what? one of the great songs nope. of the era, the wreck no. of the Edmund Fitzgerald. Oh, no, it's a no. wonderful epic. People would have forgotten song. It certainly should have been. Shouldn't have been. People would have forgotten about this famous shipwreck in 1975 in Lake Superior had it not been for this song. Yeah. And you may be aware that they um, <laughs> they recovered the bell. This is pretty cool. <laughs> this is real. This is interesting. They they have the bell now housed at Michigan State University. Oh, Michigan. Hmm. Um, it was restored by Michigan State University. It's now actually housed at the uh, Great Lakes Shipwreck Museum, and oh, they they ring, it, they ring it. They ring it. Can I please speak? <laughs> they ring it twenty nine times. This is serious, Christy. They ring they ring it twenty nine times in the it's anniversary in the of yeah. the ceremony every November tenth. Yeah. Now, uh, at three o'clock on Tuesday, they uh, at the Mariners Church in Detroit, the uh, so called Maritime Sailors Cathedral. They're going to ring it thirty times. They, what in honor of Gordon Lightfoot? That is a, a, a spitting in the face of those brave men yeah. out on no, the water. No, they're, All they're, this guy did was play guitar. I couldn't no, agree he wrote more. a great song in my book. <laughs> now, Pat, great. this is, is how you get to a continue, song. To continue honoring this with dignity, Pat. This is you? not an honor. <laughs> Someone help me. <laughs> Pat, I feel for you. You feel buddy. that what he's about to do <laughs> yeah. honors everyone yeah. involved? Everybody? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's telling us this is serious. <laughs> this is important. Now, tell us about Ella Fitzgerald's rectum, will you? Yeah, because it's... Well, check it sits down below, <laughs> like the ship we all know. The rectum of Ella Fitzgerald. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no joke. She'd scat when she sang, and her bottom would bang. <laughs> the disaster when the winds would come early. <laughs> Boy, he's spinning in his grave. The Fitzgerald family emailed me. Said, <laughs> stop singing about poor Ella's rectum. <laughs> They complained and they cussed. I threw Tom under the bus and said, I write him. It's Tom who <laughs> corrects him. <laughs> you know, a doctor had said, would always turn his head when performing her colon procedure. <laughs> There's polyps and corn and Louis Armstrong's horn. <laughs> the of Ella <laughs> you know, we we and indulge now they because ring it that makes bell. you so happy. They ring that bell 32. Yes. Please tell me that you <laughs> at least submitted that for uh, 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 to be nominated for funniest song of the year or whatever it is that you're up for. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> Can you imagine the judges having to listen to that? <laughs> what is this? Uh, <laughs> what the hell is this? What? I tell you what, Weird Al would never do that one, no. which is why it's good. <laughs> oh, I oh, love geez. Al. Oh, yeah, that's real bold stuff he does. <laughs> Eat it, eat it. Oh, yeah, yeah, it was good. Oh. How can we make this more bland? <laughs> well, these, are so, these are lame jokes. They'll play it on the Light and Lame show. Okay. He's done all right. I want you to, to, to all know we're listening to the auteur of <laughs> Who Cut the Cheese. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Careful there. <laughs> Careful there, Shakespeare. Glass house. Hey. Uh, I mean, like a sturgeon. That's witty. <laughs> it was surgeon. <laughs> like a sturgeon. <laughs> yeah, that would have been funny. That actually may have been more interesting. <laughs> I mean, that's, well, that's the one we Don't did. Don't you sully this for I want Weird Al in here one day. Don't, uh, He's been in here twice. Well, I want him in here when I'm here. Okay. <laughs> What's your fave? A Weird Al song? No. Oh, man. That's, uh, that's you, a tough The one. Weird Al movie is brilliant. After UHF is hysterical. No, I yes. mean the one right now, the new one. Uh, oh. With Daniel Radcliffe. Oh, I've not seen it. Yeah, Harry Potter. It's so in funny. It. Okay. Harry Potter's in it. <laughs> it's, it's really funny. <laughs> anyway, so I just thought we'd 
just I thought that was a really nice thing that they did. Oh for, yeah, for that's Lightfoot. a great yeah, great and, tribute and a nice uh, tribute to that of the really nice mm-hmm. thing uh, souls uh, on the ship. Uh, here's uh, Pat yeah, exactly. with the rectum song. <laughs> right. It's not called the well rectum done. song. You don't you don't give the punchline away in the title. <laughs> <laughs> it's not called. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, my point is you he, are wearing me out. You know that? <laughs> Sometimes you have to add a little um, oh, wit boy. to get people to pay attention. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, yeah. When we can start doing oh, that. That's, that's, that's some high comedy yeah, there. That's dude. Paul Lips and Corn. She's got a trumpet up her ass. Isn't that? That is, First of all, that's... you ignoramus. It's not a trumpet, okay? It's a cornet, and I uh, don't. Yeah. Where'd you get that? Oscar Wilde wrote something about that, didn't he? Yeah. Yes, yes. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Louis Armstrong's horn. A trumpet. <laughs> Fool. <laughs> probably, fool. Probably, probably, you yeah, fool. Yeah. You know what? He, when he's right, he's right. I, I should have known better. <laughs> your, that. your ignorance of the brass <laughs> I, I, has boy. no limit. <laughs> you know what a flugelhorn is? I've heard of one. Would I you rather have a cornet or a flugelhorn up your keister? <laughs> 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 the answer is cornet. <laughs> Once that, okay. that, that third valve goes in on the flugelhorn, <laughs> you'll be wishing you'd said cornet. Uh, it's my favorite line of the day. You don't give away rectum in the title. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> of course not. It's not called the rectum song. It's called rectum. Give away the punchline of the title. <laughs> so would you rather we did a we did a parody of of sundown? Oh, what could we do for that? No, I don't see you now, cause I'm six feet under and it's dark in here. <laughs> hey, let me tell you something. You know what? That was right off the top of his head. It's a little on the nose, but yeah, sure. If you could read my lips, you'd be going, they're not moving, I guess he's not talking. Oh I have to sew them shut so my mouth doesn't open during the wake. You know, that's a real art form. So i <laughs> mouth shut. Okay, thanks very much for joining yeah, us. Yeah, this has been fun. Oh, boy. Well, thank you, Christy Lee. Yeah. <laughs>